Hi guys, it's Rune, the math person. Before we get started, make sure you hit that subscribe button. If you don't want to be bombarded with all these new videos, make sure you turn off that notification. Other than that, let's just dive right into this question. In this video, I'll be going over question 82 on SO exam P, so pause the video real quick and try this problem yourself. Okay, assume you're tempted, let's just dive right in. So they insured, they issued 1250 insurance policies and the number of claims filed by a policyholder under vision care in one year is Poisson distributed with the mean is equal to 2. So then they're saying the expected value of x, where x is just 1, is equal to 2. But then we were looking for expected value of x star, where x star is ensuring 1250 of these claims. So this is equal to 2, 2 times 1250, which is equal to 2500. Zero, zero. And we also know, what we also know about Poisson distribution is that the mean and the variance of x is also the same thing. This is also going to be 2. So then knowing that the variance of x is equal to 2. So then the variance of x star is going to be 2500 zero, zero as well. And because 1250 is greater than 20, we can actually use the normal approximation. And so in order for us to use normal approximation, we need to use the standard deviation. We need to find the standard deviation. So the standard deviation of x star is equal to the square root of 2500. Zero, zero which is equal to 50. So honestly, we have all the ingredients we need to solve this problem out. So they're saying, what is the probability that there's a total of 2450 and 2600? This is star, by the way. So then normalizing the sucker out, we get 2450 minus mean, which is 2500, divided by standard deviation, which is 50, um, is less than x star, which is just x star minus mean over standard deviation is less than 2600 zero, zero, minus 2500 zero, zero, divided by standard deviation. This is the definition of z. And on the left hand side you get negative 1 is less than z is less than 2. Okay, so then we're basically looking for from negative 1 to 2. And remember on the exam they're going to give you the positive C PDF, positive CDF. So we first look at f of 2. So we first look at what z table value corresponds to 2.0, and that's 0.9772. So that's saying that this part right here is equal to 0 0.9772. Then we're going to look at 1, which tells you that this part right here is 0.8413. But what we want is actually this little bit here, right? This little bit. So in order to find that, we just do 1 minus 0.8413, which is equal to 0.1587. And so now we take the 2, right? This 0.9722 and subtract that little bit, this part right here, which is 0.1587 to get the range that we want, which is this part right here. So that's again is 9772 minus 0.1587, which is equal to 0.8185, which is our answer B. If you guys have any questions, feel free to leave them down below. Otherwise, as always, make sure you like, subscribe, and share. Bye.